Yo guys, welcome to the second episode of the West Ham United FIFA 17 career mode and today we're going to be taking on Bournemouth and Manchester City on world class as you can see. I felt that with the game against Chelsea that we won 5-0, we managed, we played a little bit too well and that we sort of Hi, abused them. They didn't have a shot, we had 28 so I thought we'd give ourselves a bit more of a challenge when we play on world class. First game at the new London Stadium for West Ham Estate this year against Bournemouth. I feel like we won this game 1-0 in a game that we really shouldn't have probably won but you know we obviously Lacazette and Deli Ali's home debuts win the ball back here oh there's a foul, gi foul given there who's going to get it we played it into they played in the box as you can see they're getting a lot more possession well they've got a lot more possession gives it to Faguli gives it to Deli Ali. Deli Ali on the break can he get another goal for the club He's going to shoot, surely. Oh, he's hit the outside of the post. What a chance that was for Deli Ali. Oh, should have been 1 0. Speaking of Deli Ali, Deli Ali plays it through to Alexandra Lacazette. Lacazette holds it up, plays through Deli Ali. Surely, in that, surely 1 0. Yes, it is. Deli Ali gets the first goal at London Stadium for West Ham United. And what a pass by Alexandra Lacazette, who made that goal. I'm not sure who's in goal for Bournemouth, but they have, even on world class. The chances just come for me. Deli Ali has scored again for me. Won it back with Noble here. Ali, Lacazette. Lacazette's going to go through here. What a run by Lacazette. Oh, is that a penalty? Yes, it is. Going to the referee. Brought down by Francis. And a yellow card will surely be given. And West Ham. And now we've got a penalty. Now Lacazette doesn't take the penalties for West Ham. We have got Mark Noble, our resident penalty taker. Definite foul, definite penalty, definite booking. Mark Noble steps up to take it. Got the arrow because I'm not that good. Mark Noble smashes it into the back of the net, past the keeper, who nearly got a touch on it. 2-0, going into the hot hour mark. We deserve this lead, even on world class. I know it's only Bournemouth, but 2-0, going into half an hour. No keeper in the world is saving that penalty. It's just too hard for them. Give away a free kick here, Winston Reid. Putting him on the line so he doesn't score. Wilshire's going to hit it, apparently. No. Daniels lays it off to Arthur. Arthur's going to shoot, and Arthur's going to score. What a goal from the computer. Guaranteed. What a strike by Harry Arthur. No question that was deserved from that kind of a move. Lovely layoff, lovely strike, clean off the left foot. No keeper in the world saving that one. Unbelievable strike from Bournemouth. They pass it. It goes into half time. And now we have a look at the stats of going into half time. Obviously, 2 1 up into this game. Are we going to be able. We aren't. We really aren't in the, in the possession. But we have had more shots than they have. Obviously, they've got 100% no actually. Deli Ali wins it. Deli Ali lobs it through. Start the second half. Lacazette, tough shot. Oh, he scores anyway. And Lacazette's second goal of the league in his first goal at London Stadium has come from a lovely Deli Alley pass. He's becoming one of the signs of the season for me. What a love ball. Francis couldn't get there. Is that Francis? I don't know if it was Francis, but no matter. Lacazette scores the goal with ease. And here we are. We're going to coming into the hour mark here. Not really a lot of stuff happened in this game, but when it did happen, it was there were really good chances. We probably could have won this game 5-1. Three, three, five, five, Lacazette hits one from distance, but great save by the goalkeeper from Bournemouth. Look at the way he's hit that. No dip. Just a little bit of spin, and it was almost edging into the back of the net. Didn't quite get the uh, the last the full-time stats, but you do sign... Joe Aribo from Charlton Athletic for a fee of £500,000 and we signed Christopher Nkuku from PSG for £2 million pounds. what a sign in 18 years of age awesome. also Mason Holgate for, from Everton and Antonio Leto from Valencia coming into the Manchester City game at the Etihad Deli Ali gets the ball here gonna shoot, gonna hit the goal and it's a goal, what a goal that is from Deli Ali. And he scored two in two consecutive games. What a goal that was as well. Just about manages to take in the, the ball there. Gets away from his man, takes it quite wide. Hits it across the goal, past Willy Caballero. 
and good goal for his, I think, third or second in the league. You get he, that Fabian Delph is going through. Creswell's going to win the ball. The referee's given a free kick. From a, we won the ball, but he's given the free kick. Is there going to be anything to follow? I think he's given a card. He's given a red card for Aaron Creswell. And I think I won the ball, so it shouldn't have been a, a it shouldn't have even been a card. Let me know in the comments down below if you thought that was a red, because I got it. I got the ball, but did I deserve to get a man sent off? Probably not. Uh, here we go. There's a slight change to the team. We put Obiat, we put uh, Gokhan Tor out in the left mid and Robert Snodgrass into the right mid to give that. We got Deli Ali here. And he's going to go through again. Surely this could be 2 0. Caballero saves. We've really, despite having 10 men, we've really been turning on the pressure. Deflected shot here turns out for a corner. Corner whipped in by Mark Noble. Deli Ali's going to rise and head it. Hit the po hit the back of them. Oh, Snodgrass hits it. It came off the line. But Snodgrass heads it into an open net. For his first goal in a West Ham shirt. And that is 2 0. And we have 10 men. It's an early goal, cleared off the line there, but Snodgrass rises. Nobody reacts to his header, and we've won, and we've gone two 0 up. Manchester City applying some pressure to their own here to go and try and get the ball into the net to get a goal back before half time. Sane tackled away, back to Sane. Sane dribbles it well. We can't clear it away. Sane still got it. Sane plays it out wide to Fabian Delph. Delph hits it and saved by Adrian. Fantastic. And a free kick's been given against Manchester City. Here, come, here comes Fernando with Manchester City. Passes out to Serge Aurier. Transferred from PSG. Aurier's found it out wide to Lukaku who transferred from Everton. And there's a goal from Leroy Sane to pull it back to 2-1. Just on the brink of half time. What a goal it was as well to put it past Adrian. What a ball this was out wide. He found him well there. He got a strong touch, Adrian. Going into half time, leading 2 1. We could have always. We could have been having 2. We could have been 2 0 up if it wasn't for the red card. Going to the match stats. We don't deserve to be. We probably. We played a little bit better than them. Had a lot more possession in this half. Here we go. Leroy Sane played down the wing. Now, guys, if you can remember to like and subscribe to my channel, that would be a fantastic. Note. Make sure to hit the notification bell as well so you never miss a video. Sane hits it. Saved by Adrian. Put back into an equaliser. And Sane's got his second goal of the game. And Manchester City's second. And have I deserved this? Probably. That was poor defending. It fell back to him. Adrian saves it and pushes it straight back to him as well. And he scored the unlikely winner the unlikely equaliser in the into the last five minutes here can Manchester City or myself pull anything back out of this game it's out to White Jesus, Na Jesus Navas into Clichy back to Navas back to Clichy and De Bruyne De Bruyne's going to whip it into Silva and they've scored a winner from 2-0 down and West Ham's 10 men and West Ham's sending off has proved pivotal in Manchester City's win and that is it. We didn't deserve to lose that game. But thank you guys for watching so much. See you in the next one.